and welcome back to some Morganum Online UC double eighty three with me Polar Dash. The map is Arctic Base. Um we're on the right side. And I I don't know how I feel about bringing a desert Zaku to an Arctic map. I know in this game none of that matters. But it matters to me. <laughs> I wanna stay thematic. So what am I bringing instead of Desert Zaku? I don't have an Arctic Zaku, even though one exists, like in the, you know, as a mobile suit in somewhere. It looks funny. It looks like a Zaku wearing like ponchos, all tied up. Yeah, it's hard to imagine, but that's what it looks like, like a white bag. It looks like it's wearing like white trash bags. It's funny looking. Um, wait, what am I bringing? This is what I usually do before starting a recording, but I decided to start this one early. Oh, Zagok! Yeah, Zagok. Get in there. Be awesome. Be all that you can be. Make me less hateful. <laughs> With your missiles and beams of joy. I'm bringing Gigan. I am because there's seven seconds left to decide and I don't feel like it deciding. I don't feel like deciding. Yeah, we're, we're okay with this. I'm actually playing uh, artillery class a lot on purpose because apparently it's pretty easy to um, rack in, in in the weekly like uh, you know top 500 for artillery class. Because, I don't know, I guess people don't play them like I do my Giga, you know, they just sit back in artillery and it doesn't get them the kind of points that Giga usually gets me. But yeah, just playing a few games puts me in the top 500, so I just want to keep it up so I can get something at the end of the week. Unfortunately, it's like I don't know. I think all my mo other mobile suits are getting jealous. Gigan is getting all, all of this attention. Especially, especially my Zakutu J. I, I haven't been fly flying my Zakutu J on this uh, with Polar lately. Because unless I fit assault classes in my deck, uh, it increases. Surely get. It increases the uh, the time it takes for me to recall. So I like having assaults in the deck. And they're fast, and they get me to places. Oh, yeah. Sure. Sure you get. So hard to hit anybody with this. Like, near nigh impossible. It's also... Oh, God! Pen attention! Staring off into space, that's what I was doing. Alright, come on, pull the dash. Like, play. Play the game. Stop mumbling to yourself like some kind of like insane old person. Okay. Hey. That is a that is a Yep, I'm still in insane old person mode. Don't know what I, what the fuck I was doing. All I cared for was launching rockets into that port of Gundams, and I did that, but it didn't produce any results, so I got sad, and I decided not to care afterwards. That was the story of those five seconds of my life. Now you know. Not that you cared. And fire. Here, put me down. It's yours. Come on, catch my God, stop hitting me! I'm not hitting anything. I'm not hitting anything. Why are my shots on him? Not where I want them to. Okay, fine. Yep, yep. Driving through artillery is a good thing to do. Good job, Holy Dash. Way to be, way to be tactically minded. Die, Gundam. Yeah, go, go burn. Go join your other fellows in Gundam Hell. 
where they belong. Look at those healers. The whole three of them, they're non-existent as usual, and I'm getting artillery for the one million time. I, I, I love my gun tanks. Yeah. Uh, so they got two and four, and we are on our way up to producing another game. This is glorious. Uh, over here, the spawning five is pointless, and I hate spawning five. I have to go through that stupid crevice. Rather take the long way out of here. Oh god. Okay. No. Fucking okay, it's, it's it sucks. Like if if you miss a single shot of that freaking sh shotgun, you're basically opening yourself up to getting hand anchored and stunned. And they can like do spinner runes and shit to make sure it hits. Stupid plane. That guy did a poison to spin a Rooney. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Us two, we knew we, one was around the corner and the other was, you know. What am I trying to say? We knew each other were around each other's corner. But he had friends. Those Gundams always, always, they always bring friends. Federation folk. They can't fight one on one, no. You know, I, I, I say say this in jest. So the things I say, like you know, I, I try to make sure that I have allies around me when I make my moves. You've been stupid. So you're fighting this guy. You weren't you weren't fighting a Zaku two artillery type like last time. You had no chance to survive there. They got seven, so what? What do I do now? Pretend that the grenade launcher is a good weapon. That's what we're gonna go out and do. Personally, I think the missile in E3 is a decent weapon. against Pixies on the, on the E3 guy, it's sad. That split second I was drawing my weapon, it cost me. That's great. We don't have a whole lot of practice on the E3 guy, so it'll be some time before I start doing well. I'm just not good at mailing in general, I just shooting things, that's all. Awesome things. Don't fuck it up, 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 don't fu
Uh, too many Gundams. Oh, I'm not that guy at the right time. Also useless sitting lying in the snow. Uh, this is what I was going here. As much as I want to go out there, this is what I can't operate up there. I, I learned the hard way many times. In the water. Let's fight Aqua GMs. Get in the water. Always remember on a Zigon to have full boost when you go to engage the enemy. Like, if you know where the enemy is, I'll always make sure, like, I, I, I always stop to recover boost as much as I can. Like, if I'm not threatened, I don't stretch out my boost too far, because having the ability to maneuver is a, a great advantage to the Zagat, because it's so fast, but, but it's boost cap as well, so you want to make sure that it's charged when you go to engage the enemy. You are done. Yeah, that advice can apply to all suits. But just suits that are especially well worn. Please get. And like you want to take the advantage that the Zagak has high boost charge and high speed. To uh, minimize the disadvantage of it having a low boost cap. Get what I'm saying? That's how I roll on those events. And keep the enemy moving all the time, like that. So you, that, that, that keeps the enemy moving. When the, when the enemy is boosting, it means that they're consuming their boost while I'm sitting here just launching missiles. Walking like there was nothing wrong with the world. Like it's strong, like this. We gain boost. Oh god! I think, I think, I only had 17 rounds in that mag, I think I forgot to reload. Cost me there. That extra shot would have killed that freaking gun cannon. You stop doing that, thank you. behind that wall. What's going on here? Where's that already? I'm shooting at a dead guy. Good job, Kai. Way, way to be 320 cars and shooting at dead guys. I'm getting artillery. I'm getting bazooka by Gundams. I'm getting tagged by snipers. I'm getting your life. Oh, yeah! Yeah! 
Yes! 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 Do the yes dance. Oh god. <laughs> Gotta kill with the rockets. Yay! Achievement unlocked. How am I in fourth place? <laughs> Paradox, it'll never be so long. Back to life! Run! The zombie Alex, oh god! Don't think sorcery got me. The confederation scum using dark magic. Fucking rogues and shit. Join this DD session. There's a party of stupid necromancers, wizards, and crows. Not my kind of session, not my kind of DD &D game. Uh, we got nothing. Uh, I don't know what to do with this man, so funny. I could have spawned on X and then carried that beacon across towards 6, but I don't think I would have made it. There's nobody up there. Nobody goes up there unless a camper places a beacon near near 6. Maybe I could have placed it up there. Whatever. Let's do that now. Kill something. Yep. Fuck! Burn! Uh, you jump in the water and you're gonna be Zaku Submariner Zagak. Just nice to die. Uh, I say what? Is it here? Punch. I guess I'll need that. Yes. See if I'm not capturing something. I didn't get my position away, that's what I'm doing. They still think their flank is clear, but nope, I've got some mariner Zigak here, walking up their day with my missiles. What the hell for the spawns? You dead? I love this thing so much! Thank you, brother. They got five. 
<laughs> Zion never wins anymore. Zion only wins when the teams are stacked. We have to stack our team so hard to win games. What are you trying to do? Let's play, come on. You had to call your Gundam. Oh, you had to call your Aqua Game friend. What the fuck? Crap, I need one more point. I need two more points. And uh, I need two more points. Oh god. You're a dead person! No! I got 40 seconds and I had two points. Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking kidding me? I decided to want to die. Out of all things. Here again, get the two points. Alright, do it. I did it. Okay, good. Thank you again. You saved my life. Where did you save me time? Let's freaking Gary Rogers. Biggest con in all Gundam. Burn. Oh god! No, 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 Trying to find the, the new guy. No, I'm getting artillery for the one million time. Artillery, yay! Yay, yay! Game over. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what am I? Fifth? Wow. How many kills did I get? Oh no. We let the Alex prototype get away. Who knows what the Federation can do with that. Ah, oh, one short. God damn it. Base damage. And there's one one brave El Mr. Diablo here. The Diablo managed to get some base damage in. The Federation. This the single con here basically won them the game, I guess. Because he probably has a deck full of pixies, and that's what they did. It's like the freaking foot soldiers don't matter. Which, whichever side has the easiest access to the enemy base wins. And I got my Johnny Ryden gold blueprint that I'm mostly likely going to trash because it won't be speed traded. But I guess that's why I'm being so hateful today. Because um, I think this will be my 12th Johnny Ryden gold blueprint. Hey, I got a master that wants me. Um, and I have yet to draw a speed trade for him. I, I hear from the pros that speed trade isn't the best trade. Spray shooter is, which I already have. The speed just makes you go faster. And it's like, what do you fucking do? They say. But I think being fast is cool. Being being a red Zaku and being fast is cool. I want one. I already have a spray shooter piece of shit, Johnny Ray. I, I want a speed one. See, this is rocket shooter. I, I'm holding on to it because it started at level 8. Usually, suits start at level 4. But if you're uh, lucky, a uh, suit will start at level 8. And it's rocket shooter. It's not spray shooter. So it's not doubling up. 
No, we, you know, we, could, we can make Johnny Rotten together. I won't scream, though. What am I using? I have a feeling if I use the gold ticket, it won't be spray shooter. It won't be speed traded. It'll be like... It'll be like a crit. And it'll be like spray shooter. But if I, maybe if I do a silver ticket, it'll be a normal success. But speed traded. You know, I might have to sacrifice something to the to the RNG gods. I sacrificed my chances at getting getting a initial level eight Johnny Ryan Saku so that I'll have a better chance of rolling speed trade. I am raising my arms to you, RNG gods. I hope you are appeased at the decision I just made. Go. I hate this game. I hate this game so much. Alright, 12 Johnny Ryden in the garbage bin. Bye, Johnny Ryden. Bye. Bye, you're not, you're not, you're not speed traded. Bye. And the next time I'll be rolling for a Johnny Ryden will be like, at like, I don't know, what was it, like 100, 200 million points? I'm not getting a Johnny Ryden speed trade. It's just, just not meant to be, I guess. The game's going well, dude. You got, you got a level spiffy, Charizaku. Where is he? Where's my level spiffy Charizaku? It ceased to exist. It's gone. Where is it? Where's my rental? Oh, just because. It's in the wrong list. I got a spiffy level level summon three Charizaku. It's like, why can't you be happy with this? And there's a good reason I want a speed traded Johnny Ryan Zaku. So that I can drop a stern boss with the rest of the campers. That's the reason. If I if I if I can get a speed traded Johnny Ryan Zaku, amp all his movement stats, put him with together with you know the, the artillery pair, which will get a deck bonus that'll add to speed, Johnny Ryan will be sort of not really, but will be able to keep up with the campers enough that He'll get there before their stern boss level the base, and leave me with nothing better to do than recall and cry, or or die from the defenders. That's what I want. I, I I want a suit that can rush base. That's what I'm trying to say, and I want it to be a Zaku, because Polar, you know, he he is the man of the Zaku. You know, I was kind of cheating when I was rolling with the Blue Destiny unit too. But I was rolling for it because because in the same gacha there exists the this guy. Right. The Zaku Flipper. Apparently, see, it's a Zaku, but he's got a triangle head. He's Triangle Man Zaku. It's a support type. So I don't really care for support types, but it's a Zaku, so I kind of wanted him but I kind of wanted him in gold. He's the one that he has the uh, the, the the what the defibrillator, the like inst insta uh, necro people. I kind of want it, but no gold suit. I got this guy. I got the broke ass. Uh, Zaka support guy. I don't really care for this guy, but he's a Zaka. Maybe I'll build him. I so don't care for this thing. It has no weapons. It's got silly machine guns. No type that. Well, his, I guess his three burst machine guns deal regular three burst machine gun damage and his machine gun. It's not like a cripple support kind. He has mines. I don't like mines. Whatever. I am ranting like an old man again. I'll see you next time. Bye.